வணக்கம் மே ஹைதர் அலி சையத் அசிவகம்சே யுனைடெட் அண்ட் தமிழ் சேவா யா ஓகே சோ बिफोर बिफोर यू स्टार्ट दिस योगा यू नो दिस स्टार्ट फ्रॉम माय इडा वर्स 6 इट टॉक्स अबाउट यू नो वॉशिंग द फेस द हैंड्स वाइपिंग द हेड एंड यू नो क्लीनिंग योर फीट राइट बिफोर डूइंग द मेडिटेशन डू यू डू दैट विद वाटर और इट इट डजंट मीन लाइक वॉश विद वाटर आल्सो इट मींस टू वॉश योर फेस विद वाटर राइट यस 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 wudu is there because um, i don't know him yeah. about um my diver 6 the verse that you know tells you to wash your face your hand your 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 head your legs so before meditation you have to you know wash with water right or yes. it's not with water yes they wash in water because even in our ancient uh, like in, in india you will find uh, wherever there is a coil or administration so they used to wash their hand and feet and uh, face and then used they used to do meditation so this is a this is a practice, ancient practice to wash their feet wash their face and even in the ancient tradition of uh, even any person is coming from outside he normally washes his feet be- okay what about the your, do you know this what is it called the one with sand cleaning your face and your hand with sand if you can't get water uh, do you yeah, understand it as that's uh, th- that's uh, the desert area when you are traveling and there is no and you want to do meditation then at least just do do what you say uh the tayam on or the sand sand bath also that's uh, that's uh, depending on the area like not uh, the five time namaz which these people are doing it's based on a fake hadith it's basically yoga and meditation and before doing yoga meditation at least you should because because the purpose of yoga meditation is get connecting with higher conscious so so we have to wash our hand and feet so that when we sit in meditation so we 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 can be connected with god so it's a process actually yeah so this is what the quran is talking about and there are two types of uh, yoga like uh, a collective yoga where everyone is getting and uh, doing med- group meditation is also there group uh, yoga or uh, exercises there and plus uh, uh, individually also one can do and and the whole purpose is that we don't need a mediator we don't need a priestly priestly cult so this is what the islam is based on khalifa or administration system okay okay I, i i think i got it anyway i'll i'll go do some reading and inshallah i'll, I'll get back to you yes but but actually the, the uh, try to read uh, borak Bo- Bo- hadith borak hadith which uh, reduces the uh, big asanas or big yoga big namaz was the 50 times and Mo- musa met prophet muhammad met musa and then uh, he reduced know, the namaz i know that i know about that one. that's actually a fake hadith so there is no short shortening of uh, salat actually there is no shortening of salat and what current muslims are doing is based on that fake hadith so that's uh, cannot be uh, uh, means uh, authentic so priestly ca- pri- pri- priest or maulana system is not a part of islam then uh, standing be- like is, like in, in the surah juma it talks about uh, standing behind the if the juma the call of juma is announced means the call of juma is actually when we get together behind the elected uh, administration so leave your trade and go attend the call for juma means uh, when the administration is calling so if the administration has called for certain uh, policy to be passed and if uh, people are not uh, attending the parliament session then it will affect them only na so that's what quran is talking about so so the quran is basically reminding about the ancient tradition way of life of yoga meditation Uh, power to people and the uh, right to administration for the common people this is what uh, uh, quran is reminding about and uh, and like uh, the the uh, anti spiritual policy is all about uh, syndicate of elites uh, taking control of the administration and where the people have no rights to talk so there are two system and this this is and uh, all religious organization is based on anti spiritual policy and spiritual policy is based on uh, uh administration 
uh, uh, and while uh, religious anti spiritual policy is based on priestly cult. So these are two systems. Okay, all right. Uh, thank you, Haider. I, I, I appreciate it. Welcome. Thank you.